Hey guys, welcome to tonight's video. And tonight I'm gonna to be talking about a super creepy and haunted object located within Myrtle's plantation. So I'm pre-recording this video because as you guys are watching it, I am at a super cool haunted location, um, which I think by now you guys already know because I am of course going to be posting pictures on Twitter and Instagram. So um, I am at the Velisca X murder house spending the night. Um, me and my friend Brittany and Jonathan and Annie were all spending the night there. We are going to be filming. We're going to be doing ghost investigations. We're going to be playing like paranormal games. Uh, like I'm so excited for you guys to see the footage from this night. It is it's gonna be amazing. So yeah, that's been the secret location that I've been going to. I've been so excited about it. Um, while you guys are watching this, we are actually there right now. Um, I'm doing the filming now, but it's not gonna be out until like Halloween. So I think I'm gonna save the video for Halloween and have it like like a Halloween finale, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, it, I cannot wait to show you guys. Anyway, I want to talk about a very haunted mirror that's located within Myrtle's plantation. Um, there's a lot of talk on the internet, or not the internet, but like there's lots of information on Myrtle's plantation, but um, I feel like this mirror doesn't get enough credit. So there is a mirror that was added to the home in 1980. And guests at the plantation have said that they've seen like shadowy figures lurking in the reflection. I mean, you guys know how I feel about mirrors and I feel like they're like a gateway to another dimension or something like, I don't know, don't get me started on mirrors because you know I think they're creepy. It is said that this mirror is haunted by Sarah Woodruff and her children. I guess many years ago she was poisoned and so were her children. And back then it was customary to cover all the mirrors um, with a cloth or whatever, a blanket, um, because it was said that spirits could get trapped in the mirror. So usually when somebody died, they would cover the mirror so that the spirits could cross over and not get trapped. Well, supposedly they didn't cover this mirror and now her and her family are trapped inside of it. So yeah, like I said, people have reported that they see like um, shadowy figures lurking in the mirror and they also say that they've um, seen little childlike handprints on the glass. Freaky, if I saw little ha child handprints on my mirror, I would run. I should probably do a video on Myrtle's Plantation on its own. Like, I guess it's a site of like a lot of like deaths and murder um, dating back to like, I think the 1700s. I'm not too sure. I haven't done a lot of like investigation on it, but I think I'm gonna do a whole video on Myrtle's Plantation because it's a very haunted location. Anyway, what do you guys think? Do you think that um, Sarah and her children are trapped inside the mirror? Do you think this is something that's even possible? I don't know, for me, I think, I don't know. I think anything's possible. Like I've told you guys before, I think there's a lot of stuff out there that we do not know anything about, um, different dimensions, different worlds. And so, I, you know, I think anything is possible. Maybe they are trapped inside the mirror, but um, I don't know. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you want to see some sneak peeks of the Velisca Axe Murder House, um, go to my Twitter or my Instagram. I'm going to be putting some pictures and stuff on there so you can take a peek. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.